County and state officials joined the McKinney Hills community in Silver Spring to dedicate a school to a very special person. MCPS TV has a story. One, two, three, and cut. With that ribbon cutting, Flora M. Singer Elementary was officially dedicated June 10th, 2013. The school is named for the late Flora Singer, a Holocaust survivor, author, and MCPS teacher. It is believed to be the first public school in America to be named after a Holocaust survivor. Look what we have created together. Principal Kyle Heatwall emphasized the importance of the school's community in embracing the legacy of Flora Singer and celebrating a brand new building for elementary students in Silver Spring. Although I never had the chance to meet her, I'm inspired by her work. We will strive to carry out her legacy as we not only educate our students academically, but we work to meet their needs and teach them the importance of good character. The event was attended by more than 200 community members and by many dignitaries, including Board of Education President Christopher Barclay, Superintendent of Schools Joshua Starr, County Executive Isaiah Leggett, U.S. Senator Ben Cardin, and U.S. Representative Chris Van Hollen. When I think of people who were truly a testament to the strength of the human spirit, I think of people like Flora Singer. Uh, and as others have said, when students pass through these hallways, and people ask them, why is your school named after Flora Singer? You've got a lot to tell them. After surviving Nazi persecution in Belgium during World War II, Flora Singer came to the United States, raised a family, went to college to become a teacher, and dedicated her life to ensuring the horrors of the Holocaust were not forgotten by future generations. She was a tireless campaigner for education, human tolerance, and human rights. She inspired and facilitated change in her students and others she met along the way. She remained an optimist with hope in mankind, and she taught her students and listeners that with hard work, education, commitment, and faith, individuals could succeed despite incredible odds. For this former student, her influence remains. She was really good at teaching. Um, she was just really made a lasting impression on me. Such a fitting tribute to an inspiring and remarkable lady. Through her works and now the school, she will always be remembered.